Welcome to the tutorial on Introduction to Blender Video Editor. In this tutorial, we will learn to Download and install Blender 2.82a on Windows 10 OS and Ubuntu Linux 16.04 OS Open the Blender interface Add a video file to the sequencer panel. Zoom and move the video in the preview panel. Play an excerpt of the video in the preview panel. Toggle time and frame number and save the project. To record this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux version 16.04 OS. Firefox Web Browser 75, Windows 10 OS, Microsoft Edge 40 Web Browser, Blender 2.82a and a working internet connection to download Blender. To follow this tutorial, learner must be familiar with basic computer and internet skills. For prerequisite tutorials, please visit this site. Files used in this tutorial are provided in the code files link. Please download and extract the files. Make a copy and then use them while practicing. The download link for Blender is shown here. Open any web browser and go to the given Blender download link. The current release is 2.82a. When you practice this tutorial, the version number may be different. Click on the pull down as seen. Notice the downloadable files for many operating systems. Here we can also see the source code for Blender. Now let's download and install Blender on Windows 10 OS. I will choose the Windows Portable SIP file installer. The download may start automatically in some systems. If a dialog box opens, choose to save the file option and click on OK, as seen here. Allow the file download to complete. Open the file manager. Go to the downloads folder. The file is downloaded into this folder for me. Select the zip file and right click on it to open the context menu. Click on extract all. An extract all dialog box opens. I will retain the default folder and click on extract. The process takes a minute or so and we can see the progress. Allow the process to be completed. Notice the extracted Blender folder in the Downloads folder as seen here. Double click to change directory to the newly created Blender folder. Double click on the folder to open the Blender directory. Notice the Blender application in this folder. The program is already compiled for you. Double click on the Blender application file to open the Blender interface. Now let's download and install Blender on Ubuntu Linux 16.04 OS. Click on the Download Blender 2.82a link seen in the blue color box. The page refreshes and the save file dialog box opens. Choose the save file option and click on OK to download the file. Allow the download to complete. Open the file manager and go to the downloads folder. My downloaded file is in the downloads folder. Notice the downloaded blender file with XZ extension. Let's open a terminal, extract the files and open the Blender interface. 
Open the terminal by pressing Ctrl Alt and T keys together. A terminal opens. Change the directory to the downloads folder. Type the command as seen here to extract the files. Press enter to execute the command. The files are extracted to a new directory as seen here. I will clear the screen for clarity. Enter the newly created directory by using the cd command as seen here. Type ls to list the files in the directory. Scroll up and notice the Blender file. It is already compiled for you. For me, the listed files are color coded. Here, the green color indicates that the Blender file is an executable. If you have a non-executable file, please use the command as shown here. This will change it to an executable file. I will clear the screen for clarity. In the terminal prompt, type dot slash blender. Press enter to execute the command and open the program. The blender interface opens. Let's change the interface appearance and colors. Click on edit preferences. The Blender Preferences dialog box opens. Click on Themes seen on the left side frame. From the pull down on the top right, choose Blender Light. The interface changes to a lighter shade. Click on the X sign on top left to close the dialog box. Click on File New in the top menu. Here we can see many options, 2D animation, sculpting, VFX and video editing are 4 working modes in Blender. Click on the video editing option. The interface changes to the video editing mode. Let's choose a video file to edit. The panel on top left is a file browser to browse through files and folders. It is in the user home directory now. I have downloaded and saved the input file in the videos folder. Scroll down and select the videos folder. Double click to change directory to videos. My input video is a webm format video file. Select the file. Left click hold and drop the icon on the sequencer panel. In the bottom. The sequencer panel has many channels. The video gets added to a channel in the sequencer panel. You will see two strips. The blue strip is the video part. The green strip is the audio part of the video. Notice that we can also see a preview of the video in the preview panel. To adjust the zoom level in the preview panel, do the following. Left click, hold on the plus sign seen on the right side of the preview panel. Use the mouse scroll wheel to adjust to desired zoom level. To move the video, click and hold the palm sign on the right side. Then. Move the video in the preview panel. Place the cursor on the numbers at the top of the sequencer panel. Then left click. It shows the time position in the video. Press Ctrl and T keys together. This toggles the time information to the frame number. Let's play the video for a few seconds. Press the space bar to play the video. The video plays on the preview panel. Press space bar again to stop playing the video. Notice the video editing and rendering workspaces or tabs on the top menu. On the right side, notice the settings panel. 
we can change the output settings here. Let's save the project. Click on File Save to open a Save dialog box. I will save the files in the Videos folder and type First Project for file name. Click on the Save Blender file. It is seen at the lower right side for me. Click on File Quit to quit Blender. Now let's summarize. In this tutorial, we downloaded and installed Blender 2.82a on Windows 10 OS and Ubuntu Linux 16.04 OS, opened the Blender interface, added a video to the sequencer panel, learned to adjust zoom and move the video in preview panel, played the video in preview panel, toggled time and frame number in sequencer panel, and saved the project. For assignment activity, please do the following. Explore the Blender interface and browse through the Blender user forum in the given link. This video summarizes the Spoken Tutorial project. Please download and watch it. We conduct workshops using Spoken Tutorials and give certificates. Please write to us. Do you have questions in this spoken tutorial? Please visit this site. Choose the minute and second where you have the question. Explain your question briefly. The spoken tutorial project will ensure an answer. You will have to register to ask questions. The spoken tutorial forum is for specific questions on this tutorial. Please do not post unrelated and general questions on them. This will help reduce the clutter. With less clutter, we can use this discussion as instructional material. Spoken Tutorial Project is funded by MHRD, Government of India. This is Rani from IIT Bombay. Thank you for joining.